It's time to kick ass and watch verbal processing. And I'm all out of ass. Go! Greetings, Go Processors! Ian here with Verbal Processing, and I'm getting my mouse cursor off the screen, and I'm getting attacked! The bats have brought their leechy friends. I wonder if this is like a leech man from the X-Files. I think... There's a bunch of, like, really sad Futanari girls over here. They escaped from us, and now we have nothing at all! Mm, and if you get that, you've been watching some naughty stuff on the internet. <laughs> Why do we celebrate things like killing trees? I don't really understand this. Oh, you know what? Gotta be really careful because there's not a ton of health between here and the boss. So I want to avoid taking damage from these projectiles. Like that, for instance. Let's sneak back around to the berobed ones. Yes! Bringing them down! You got heavy purse! You brute, you 20,000 gills! So, I've unlocked? That's not an unlock, okay? That's an achievement. Alright? There's a difference. There's a difference! People, please, game designers, get it straight. First of all, achievements suck! Alright? Actually, I take that back. I have, um, fallen for many of- uh, fallen for. <laughs> Here's my take on achievements nowadays. I want them integrated in the game. If they pop up and they come from Steam or whatever, I ain't interested. Because that says to me that it's an overlay, that it's a gimmick. It's like, hey, do this thing that has yeah, pretty much no reward associated with it. And uh, we'll, you'll have played our, I mean, basically you, you get nothing out of it. You'll have played our game some more. And I get the idea that it's like, you know what, I think they're just not for me. Because I'm not the type of person that says, hmm, I need to 100% this game in negative in 68 seconds and uh, get into the dark world without any panties on, what have you. So, I don't know, that concept just doesn't appeal to me all that much. And I understand the mentality of like, I want to push myself. I want to be the very best, like no one ever was. Take this lich... My master has ordered me to stop you. He will soon rule the world and I will be the chief of his armies. The power of the crystal will not protect you this time. Prepare to die. He's got no more words, but he's got some horny head. Okay, mom. Mm-hmm. Okay, this guy, you kind of have to take him slow and steady. The best thing to do is get him on the top side of a grave. And you can kind of just, you can, oh, he's hitting me a little bit, but it's not, I'm not really taking any significant amount of damage. You, can, you don't take any of his projectile damage, and you can kind of just bag on him. Uh, no, dude. We're over here now. Am I taking, yeah, I'm taking a tiny amount of damage, but, okay, this is where it gets problematic. That's where I got to get on the move, and then I kind of got to kind of play, play conservative. And spend some time just dealing with these zooms here. Oh, see, now that's not so good. Just get blasted by, ooh. I probably was a null sum game at best. Hey, up here, up here, up here. Hey, look at that. Yeah, I'm taking claw damage. Because I'm, I'm ahead of the claw damage game. That's right. So, oh, Evil Land developers. I think I figured out the secret of this. Oh, I can do this, I can do this, I can do this, I can do this. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, we got it going on. Something happened somewhere. You can be sure it's the last time for that. Oh boy! Evil Land's coming to a close pretty soon. Oh, I can tell you though that there is quite a lot of Minecraft coming to the channel. VP Plays Games, the new gaming channel, um, very soon with Bebop Vox. I'm not like a Minecraft specific channel, but I do love to play me some Minecraft. And so we've been playing some walls on the Hypixel server. Ooh, it's a blue abyss! What? Who knows what kind of inside-out shenanigans that blue fog would play upon my tiny, sexy carcass. Speaking of sexy carcasses, they were showing a game called, oh, they were showing uh, Rayman. What was it, Rayman? I forget the subtitle, but anyway, they were showing a CG trailer for the new Rayman game down at E3. And if you, uh, if, by the way, if you're, I'm live streaming this, so it just occurred to me, I'm looking at the camera, but I don't have face cam set up for, for YouTube yet. Do you want to return to the main menu? No, I'm good. I'm totally good. Oh, I got this portal now. Awesome. Red! You know what? Uh, one downside of the situation here is I'm not running any kind of a timer, so I don't know how long I've been playing for at this point. Uh, let's see, looks like the stream has been up for about 15 minutes. I bet you I've been up for about five, so we'll go for another five for this episode! Okay, so, um, here was something, something Basher pointed out when we were watching the live stream of the E3 coverage together, is they show this trailer and it starts out with a basically like a chibi girl. I mean, it looks like a girl. Not, not a woman, just like, you know, an 11-year-old with 
gigantic boob physics, full on boob physics, boobs. And it's kind of a disturbing image. It's the kind of image you don't feel good about being interested in. You're like, ah, that's kind of weirdly attractive in some ways, but not the head, not the head, not the head, okay? Seriously. Uh, but it was a, it's a creepy choice that they made for that, in my opinion. Like, it is really borderline uh, there, and I was, you know, disturbed. Disturbed with myself and others. By the way, I was at the, that was when I was at the Ubisoft booth. Okay, when I'm looking through here, I don't know why my backpack was flashing. So, Crystal Mastery Scroll, Silver Armor, Sacred Bow, blah, 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 blah. I'm actually not sure who I'm supposed to be talking to at this point, so I guess I need to start making my way through the village, yeah? Now, I'm not sure why they dropped me right here. Running around is really tiring! Oh, that's right, this is Old Guy Village. Running around is really tiring! I'd rather pay with firecrackers. It's hard to get surprised these days. Ah, still have some quality gear for a very fair price. Bye. Okay, I don't need a rare card at all. Fast DVD player. No, no, no. Well, I mean, I might as well, actually. Bye-bye, uh, slow, sleepy, lonely thing. Times I can't speak anymore because there's a goblin in my mouth and he's making out with my tongue. And it's pretty awkward, I can tell you that. Okay, but... Oh, why not? Uh, let's get a couple of those. Yep, bye. Phoenix down. And I won't need potions as long as... As long as Carius or... Uh, excuse me, Stream Cheese is with me! Okay, here we go. Well, what the, honey? The ruins of Sarunak to the northeast hold many treasures and dangers. Oh, you seem like a nice guy, so I'll give you a discount on any bone mending if you go there. Do you need any healing now? I don't know if I do. Might as well take some. Why don't you come inside and let me heal your wound? <laughs> Save your game now. Yes, absolutely. All right, down we go. I'm gonna go across to the other side of the village and take a look at what I can find on this side. You got any haggis? Please! I need some haggis! There's gotta be some in here! You got it stored in that tiny little booty of yours, don't you? I'm gonna fish him out. Uh, I should probably have talked to her. She's like, uh, what was all that about my booty? I'm not interested in any of that kind of shenanigans. Welcome to old guy! Our village was once flourishing. But now we're really old. Look at it. The mana tree used to protect the whole country. It got old too. Now something powerful has come back to the Black Citadel. I'm assuming it's teenagers. And they've got a piece of my lawn that they're playing on. And started corrupting the mana tree to spread waste. I think they're going to sit up there and egg my car. I fear the whole of old guy will be gone soon, and it will not stop here. All right. Just realized those are just photographs of trees in the background there. I was really hoping the village would become full 3D at some point. Spectacular rotating pixels. Let's see what. Okay. Let's see Caesar salad. Uh, what? Are we, oh yeah, he's in the. He's in the. Uh, oh, that's right. I made him like this. Well done. Now that you have the whole amulet! I think I added the singing just now, but whatever. What do you guys care? It's up to me. It's my show. Okay. You can enter the Black Citadel. You will find it to the east of Old Guy. Just past the river. Good luck! Okie dokie. East of Old Guy, just past the river. I used to be... Oh, come on. Yeah. You took it up the patoot. That's where the arrow went, and then when you pooped, it was like a fuzzy pumper, and it went out in four shapes. Assuming it was a four-sided arrow. All right, I would help you, but unfortunately, I cannot fight anymore, and I have a super crazy deep voice. Do you guys ever watch Adventure Time? Because I learned something very interesting about Adventure Time. Actually, but I'm going to have to tell you on the next episode. See you next time. Cheers. Bye.